Yo, what is up everybody? Welcome to episode one of my Escape from Tarkov playthrough series. This is something I've been wanting to do for a long time, way before I started doing Rust videos. I had this idea for quite a while. I thought it'd be a really fun series to do, but the problem was at the time when I did it, I really didn't know much about this game. So during last year's October wipe, I want to say 2019 October wipe, I think it was, is when I really started to kind of learn the game a bit or put some effort towards learning it. I've owned the game since maybe like 2018, 2017, maybe. I don't remember played it a little bit with friends never really got into it and then just before that october wipe i saw some gameplay of it and i was like damn this game really went a long ways so during the october wipe i kind of learned it a bit didn't get kappa but then the previous earlier in the year previous wipe 2020 early 2020 i think it was march maybe it wiped i don't remember but uh, during that wipe, I did get Kappa. I think I got it like a month into the wipe. So uh, yeah, after that, I've just been waiting for it to wipe again so I could start the series and now we're here. So yeah, I'm just gonna play the game, go for Kappa, give my tips if I have any. I'm not the greatest at the game. I know a little bit about the game. I'm not an expert yet, but I think doing the series would definitely help me get to that level maybe eventually but we will see so yeah i'm just gonna play the game nothing much else to it um if you're coming from the rust videos um, i'm sure some of you also play tarkov they're kind of similar games in a way but um yeah i hope you enjoy it i think this series will be a lot better this is a better game for the kind of playthrough series um rust it gets kind of repetitive really but this there's always the quest to get in a kappa it's a long journey there's plenty of stuff to do for this game there's plenty of different scenery instead of rust where you just kind of it's re more repetitive which i mean it's not that big of a deal but i think it would be better i'm kind of going on a ramble i just want to get started so uh yeah let's do it so english can we do this that should be good all right i'm gonna do usec i always do usec i just like the english voice lines you do get different stuff this wipe though and i'm still gonna do usec anyways doesn't really matter and we're gonna do taylor we're gonna do josh just to keep it classic josh is the usec 3 voice and then taylor is just the normal dude now as of now i haven't actually played a raid i have two accounts so i have one account for this series which is a standard account and then i have my other main account which is the eod version and i've never did a raid yet on this wipe but i did go into my eod account and just checked shit out for a little bit and that's how i knew what characters to select and stuff but uh yeah we're just gonna get right into it uh first thing i'm gonna do is accept these beginning tasks straight from the get-go so i think we just got proper Therapist, don't have you yet. Nothing from you. Nothing from you. Don't have you yet, and that's it. Okay, and the next thing we gotta go through and inspect all this stuff, so I'll do that really quickly. All right, so I just went through and inspected everything, so we're all good on that. Uh, there might be some stuff in our stash that we can inspect, maybe. No, it doesn't look like it. That's weird, okay. Anyways, all right, so we got messages for the quests. I also want to check my settings, make sure all my stuff is good. Let's see. Yeah, so it looks like everything is saved from last time, which is really nice. So yeah, some of my settings. I have the interface, everything on the interface showing the entire time. It's the way I like it. Um, I have my dude colored. I, think, I don't know if that's new or not, but I've seen that other people use it. I kind of like it. So I'm going to have, have that on. Um, everything else is good. FOV, I have that on max. Graphics, usually just just medium, just basic stuff. Post effects, I don't use post effects. I just haven't found settings that I liked, so I just leave it off. Sound, um, I don't have, inter I have the interface really low. I have the music off, and have this checked on. And my controls, um, it's some weird shit that I do. Discard, I have is X. Hold breath, I have is left control. I have to hold it to hold breath, and that's pretty much all the weird stuff. I think everything else is default. I believe. I'm not sure though. But yeah, if you have a question, just let me know. <laughs> All right, so we do that. Then one more thing I want to do is get to the Christmas gift from the website. I don't know if I have to exit game to get it, but I know you go to the website, but I don't know if you have to restart game for it to show up, but we'll try. All right, it says I activated the gift successfully. Oh, there it is. Nice. That was easy. All right, so we'll transfer all this, and we don't even have room for all at all. Damn. <laughs> uh, having standard stash is gonna be rough. Can return later. Okay, good. Let me um move some stuff around in here. First, we'll inspect everything. All right, then we can put all the ammo in the ammo case. All right, and then we'll see. After moving all that stuff, we can still get any of this. We'll inspect this. All right, we still don't have room for this. It's just a. Uh, oh, it is armor too. Okay. Um, we can put a lot of this shit into here. All right. How about now? 
Oh, it's a four by four. Why don't I just remember that? There we go. Now it should fit. And nice, 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 nice. Okay, so, um, yeah, let me see. Let me do a scav in six minutes. Uh, let me organize some more crap and let me see what we can do. I think I'm just gonna go like crazy right away. Just bring this right away. Might as well use it. Can I buy just normal? They give you one, two, three, four drums. Why? <laughs> oh my god, that's crazy. Okay, um, give you night vision too. Damn, might use that. This is nuts. All right, um, let's just load this with BP. BP is really good ammo. <laughs> load one in the chamber. You in there? And might as well, might as well do that. We'll carry a stack with us in there. And then I don't carry a knife. I just pick up knives from scavs and sell them just to get a little bit of extra money. So we'll take that away. We're gonna run out of space so fast. It's gonna be, it's gonna be crazy. Anything else? Vaseline painkiller. Okay, we can put you here. Don't need you. Bandages, splint. Four, five, six. This stops heavy bleeding, doesn't it? See, I didn't. I never played with the heavy bleeds. I never checked it out after they added it. I checked out the customs expansion for like a day, and that's it. <laughs> but uh, ever since the end of March, I really never touched this game. So just bear with me for the first few episodes. Might be a little rough. Might take a bit to get it back in the swing of things, but we will. It's gonna be good. Trust me. Hideout. Can we do anything in the hideout right away? Ooh, one thing we want to do is med station. We want Lua's actually find and raid or craft three of them yeah so we want to do that like right now uh, med station instruct you and fuel on the generator okay where's generator at generator 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 security one okay then generator here get that we start with fuel which is really nice so we got that going and then we can start doing this boom so in a half hour we only have one saliva which is good and that's really all i want to worry about for the hideout right now because we just spent a decent amount of money not too much um we'll replace you we don't need these we can sell these i think we sell them to ragman let me double check yeah we don't need you and then we will use this helmet decent helmet put you on we'll wear you because why not and then i think we are good to go i bring one of these i'll try these i don't even know um a thousand okay so they're pretty cheap okay all right i don't think we need anything else i think we are good to go just want to double check this stash is a mess already i hate it <laughs> all right tasks scavs meds you're not level five yet that's all we have i believe Okay, pretty simple. Uh, we can scav around right away, but the problem with that is we have no room for anything at all. So, you know what, let me make room really fast. All right, it's still a disaster, but I did save a lot of space by packing in a lot of stuff into these rigs, and then the backpacks into backpacks, and then the rig into backpacks, and then more stuff in the rig. Oh, classic uh, Tarkov Tetris. And yeah, we cleared some space up. I'm actually gonna sell this knife. I don't know who to sell it to. I always, I think it's fence. It is fence for knives. I think until we get Jaeger, he's gonna be the best guy to sell him to. All right, I just inspected some more things that fence will have. He's gonna get a bunch of random stuff that we'll be able to keep inspecting for now. So yeah, we made some space in the stash. It's still a mess. Uh, we got a loadout ready to go, I think. I don't think I'm missing anything. I think we're good. Um, actually, have, do we have glasses? I thought we had glasses. Maybe that's EOD, you start with glasses or else I'm blind, but I was gonna throw those on, but it's fine. But uh, anyways, I'm going to go on a scav since it's ready, since we spent so much time organizing. I did not expect to take that long. Um, I should have known better, but it's all right. So we're going to go shoreline. I like scaving at shoreline. I think it's a really good place to scav. Bunch of stashes, bunch of meds. We need to find meds. Bunch of stuff we need to find in raid um, for tasks in the future. So that's what we're going to do. All right. So we got into a scav match on shoreline. I just got to reorientate myself. I think I know where I'm at. So yeah, we're just going to hit up these stashes. There's one under this bridge. Cool. 
I gotta remember where everything's at. Um, you don't remember ever spawning there. Last wipe. Um, where are the other stashes at? There is the radio tower. We can go up there if we want to. Or the weather station, I should say. Let's go to the resort. There's more stashes out here, but I'm gonna have trouble remembering where they're at. Wait, maybe right here. I think there's one. Yep, nice. Range. I, we might need those, honestly. Eventually. I don't remember, though. I know we need, like, morphines. Um, blood. Blood sets. Uh, I can't remember anything off the top of my head. These first few episodes are going to be kind of really cloudy memory-wise for me. But once I get back in the swing of things and I start playing this on stream, I'll definitely be ahead on my stream account, on my main account, eventually. Right now, this is the first raid ever of this wipe on either of my accounts. So as I play more on stream, I'll definitely be sinking more hours faster on my uh, main account on stream. Then once I'm there and get most of the stuff done there, I'll definitely be more prepared for when I do these recordings. We gotta be careful here because the resort is pretty pretty hot and then the other stash is like right here and they it's either a bug or an intended that you can't really walk away from what you're looting anymore i want to say they intended to do that because it is kind of Weird that you can loot something and then like kind of run and take cover somewhere else. And there's jackets. So literally, see, I can't move when I loot. I gotta get used to that. So we pretty much want to loot like every single thing we see. Like container wise. Gas analyzer, that's big. Light bulbs are pretty good. Motor, we can make space for that. It's a duffel bag. Hard drive. Um, all right, we're good. Ruined Road. I think I remember where that's at. We're just gonna head there now.
So like we're kind of in the middle of the map. We want to go to the other side. Like this direction. Where'd he go? I saw you. I don't know where that guy went. Now, like I said, it's going to be... First few episodes, I got to get back in the swing of things, and then it'll be all good once I... Get used to doing stuff again. So I literally, I have not really like played played this game in in months. And something I meant to mention before I kind of got into the raid is I'll probably do long versions and short versions, kind of like how I do my rest videos. I don't know how well it's gonna work out this game having short versions. I feel like people if they like series they'd rather watch the full raid but I'll cut out all the dead space two of the raids as well so there will be a long version and a short version For slugs, baby. There's multiple dead bodies. There's this guy. And this guy. And this is the guy I killed. Taz is actually big. Um, you also want this shotgun too, so we'll ditch. Ditch you. Oh, whoops, not that. Fuck. Take this off. Ditching you. The one task, we do need it. I don't know if they have to be found in raid anymore. I think they do have to be found in raid now. Ugh, I want the light bulb. out of here. So this guy had slugs too. Hold up. I can check what... Oh no, because we're a scav. Never mind. We can't see. I think it's these shotguns. MP133 or 153? I don't remember. I'm pretty sure it's the pump ones.
hope I'm going to the right spot. I know uh, South Passage was actually probably closer when we were at the resort, now that I think about it. Or is Ruin Road? Oh no, wait, this isn't Ruin Road. Ruin Road's more this way. That's not good. I thought this was Ruin Road. It's not Ruin Road though. But there is a stash right here. Um, what should we ditch? Soap? I really don't know. I have a feeling that's better. This is where it's going to get sketchy. As you can see. Or here, I should say. Maybe there's a guy firing off a gun as he was leaving. That's what I'm hoping. This is it. Yes. Oof. All right. Nice. <laughs> All right. Success. First time. First try. Got that gas analyzer, which is big. All right. So yeah. So it's gonna transfer everything over, and we got the shotgun too. I'm pretty sure we want that. Yeah. That's everything. Nice. Then let's double check that this is the shotgun we need. Go we'll unload all this. We'll sell the ammo. Take this off. We'll sell that. Let's see. Trading. Tasks. Debut. Yep. Nice. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Nice. So we did awesome. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. This Taz, I'm pretty sure we want to save. It might. They might be finding raid now. They weren't in the past, but it's one less Taz we have to buy now, at least. And then we're going to sell... Pretty much everything else. Keep the vog. Sell the knife. Sell, sell, sell the gas mask. Don't want to save these. I got to review like what we need to keep and what we need to sell. I'll sell the shotgun ammo. Don't need that. Might need this stuff. I think we need G phones. And sell you, sell you. Keep this. Probably drink that. We'll hold on to it. We can sell the rig, the Tarzan. Keep the motor. Put the fuel in the hideout. MREs we need to keep. And then keep the cigarettes. Keep this. Keep this. Sell, 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 sell. Sell everything up top. 
hideout we can put the fuel in so we have two slots and then this it's almost done got like a minute we'll go back to that trading so you and you you and you so all this to you so this to you all right our hideout is done so we'll go back to that get you and we'll start crafting another one right away so we need to buy used to with the flea market is really nice once we unlock flea market it'll be better but you just go to filter item and you just buy them there buy there and then you're good but just an extra step we just got to go to the u buy one of yaws and i i already forgot what we needed bandage okay so do that go back in start crafting that like that good and then we can turn the one in that we have very nice so we just need two more which will be done in a half hour we'll get another one and um and yeah i'm gonna end the first episode there i really appreciate the watching and again i apologize for it being kind of scuffed the first few episodes are gonna be a little scuffed i gotta get back in the swing of it one Two, I gotta get used to making these episodes. The first time I've done a series of this game, so yeah, I gotta get used to how I, the style, the recording, how I want to say stuff, word stuff, and all that good stuff that goes along with it. Stuff, 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 stuff. <laughs> and yeah, not bad. We did a scav run on Shoreline. Got a gas analyzer. We got a shotgun for our one per task. We got the Taj shotgun, which we'll use for skier later. And we got some more stuff and then again i apologize for not being as prepared or ready to know like the extracts what to keep what to sell that will come one time I, I will get i will get it down especially when i start playing this on stream more which i'm going to start doing tomorrow so maybe by episode past episode five i think we will be on a way better path but anyways i'm gonna end the episode there really appreciate the watching thanks again peace out yo thanks for watching be sure to check out the rest of the channel and the other playthrough episodes i stream on twitch so check that out as well Join the Discord, and if you want to see more videos similar to this one, be sure to subscribe. Also, leave a like. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave a comment in the comment section below. Thanks again. Peace.